guys welcome to toilet series on SolidWorks and uh, let's get started so first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to the top plane and make a sketch click on normal tool and turn on the wireframe view and using spline we're going to draw this this thing and then we are going to align it with the blueprint like that okay and then we're going to use spline again here 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 and here. press escape and then just decrease the height of this handle here you can see like that like that Okay, and then we are going to use line command from here to here from this point to this point. Press escape, get out of the sketch, and turn on the edges, uh, shaded with edges view, and then keep the sketch selected. Go to curves, split line, and select both these. Uh, surfaces and click OK and we'll get this uh, spl uh, I mean the split line so the next thing we're going to do is the rear view turn go to the rear view make a sketch on the rear plane the, uh, this one make a sketch on that and using slot command here like that from here make sure that should be horizontal like that like that All right. So just try to drag it down a little bit. All right. After that, what we are going to do is we are going to go to feature. I mean, scale surfaces and go to trim surface and select both of these surfaces keep selected the remove selections and click on OK so here you can see the surface is uh, deleted and we'll go to the right view and after that we'll go to sketch then 3d sketch and using line command we are going to draw a reference line because we need an incl inclined plane so from here here like that and make sure make sure it should be uh, in with uh, with parallel parallel with the x-axis all right as you can see you get the yellow color indication click that and Press escape, get out of the sketch, and so we'll go to reference geometry plane and the three reference uh, we need to uh, make a plane. The first is this point, second is this point, and the third is this point. Okay, we get we, uh, now we have this plane. Click OK, keep the plane selected, 
and go to and make a sketch and then go to the rear view and go to slot again from this middle make sure it should be horizontal like that okay right click select get out of the sketch and uh, hide all these blueprints for instance right view for example and rear view and this new plane as well hide it okay now hide this sketch as well okay now we are left with two slots one this this one and the other is this one so we will go to uh, fill surface fill surface select this one and we'll get and it will fill the surface uh, fill the sketch and we'll get the surface and the second thing we are going to do is we are going to go to loft command uh, but before we go to loft command uh, we need to make some sketches here 3d sketch using line command from this point with this one press escape then go to rear view and try to align it like that so this will act as the guide curve so get out of the sketch go to 3d sketch again we need at least two guide curves so from this point this point to to that All right let's go to the rear view here you can see get out of the sketch and we have we have these two guide curves so we'll go to lofted surface selection manager select these edges <coughs> select these edges all right and click OK then go to selection manager again and select this slot like that and click OK and now guide curves select this line all right and another one is here so you can see that we have got a surface a very good looking uh, surface and we click OK all right so so after doing that, the next thing we are going to do is we are going to uh, bring a number plate at uh, at this bonnet. So we'll go to front view, turn on these uh, front view blueprint, and we're going to make a sketch on the front plane. And we'll go to rectangle command from here to here right click select get out of the sketch and uh, and this is it so we'll go to features extrude and from sketch plane here we have to select uh, a surface face or plane for that we'll click here and the extrusion will be five millimeters and uh, click OK and we'll go to front front uh, plane again make a sketch on that and using line command
like that. Press escape. So now we get a close figure. Get out of the sketch. Here, um, go to features, extrude. Here, the selected contours is going to be. Alright, it's okay. And the surface and plane, that should be this one. Alright. Let me click on OK. And let's hide the front uh, blueprint. Front blueprint, hide it. And uh, now we're going to mirror. Here it is. And the reference plane should be the right plane. The bodies to mirror this one. On that okay now we get uh, get the number plate and then let's turn on the front view on the front blueprint so now we are going to write the 911 Carrera how are we going to do that we're going to do that by going to front plane making a sketch on that and go to text and there we can see use document format uncheck it just type 911 here okay and then click on front font and here font should be 60 millimeters unit and uh, and the type of font is freestyle script I think, uh, yeah, Freestyle Script is the name of the font that uh, is used in this 911 Carrera. So we'll click OK and we'll click here. Here you can see, oh, all right, and go to, and here it is. You can see it is little inclined. So we'll go to and make it oblique. Click OK. Now you can see it is. It looks uh, inclined a little bit, so all right. Let's all right. So there you go. And also write C here because um, we can extrude, we can uh, extrude on only one surface uh, at once. So let's use C as well here. So C here, you can see, is getting a little farther. Let's see the block letters. Okay. All right. And after that. Okay, after all right, this is correct, and click OK. So Get out of the sketch, keep that thing selected, 
can go to extrude and uh, here we we select the surface and it should be this one so we get that let's make it uh, two millimeters let's see how it looks let's hide this front blueprint first Okay, this is two millimeters, which is okay. Two millimeters is okay. Click OK. Now we get a beautiful font. Now we will uh, type the rest of it by going to front view. Turning, turn on the front blueprint and make a sketch on the front plane. Click on normal tool. And here we'll go to text, uncheck it, go to font, make it 60. And uh, go to freestyle script. Click OK. And what is the right? This is the okay. Let's all right. This is correct. Click OK. I think we have a problem. Double click it. All right, double click it. And All right, it's okay. So get out of this sketch here you can see keep it selected extrude and the surface should be this one and the two millimeters click OK so hide the front view I mean the front blueprint and now we get a beautiful nine one one.